Welcome back my children to another Mortal Kombat X video. I will be continuing the Fatal Sorcerer's Tower. I left off at match 71. I did not do uh, the Fatal Sorcerer's Tower yesterday at all. So I missed it, uh, missed on doing the, the, um, the tower three times. But anyways, I'm gonna try doing it twice since it's almost 10 p.m. and at 10 p.m. the attempts are gonna reset which is in 16 minutes so I'm gonna do this one quick and then do the other one after I record some like two other videos but anyways I'm gonna switch to my team Ronin Kenshi, Assassin Jade and Hellspawn Scorpion and I'm facing Day of the Dead Aaron Black, Commando Kano and Classic um, Scorpion the modifier is Toxic Bomb. Too much to read. I'm not gonna read it for now. And I have the right equipment, I believe, for all three. Yes, I do. Anyways, first to battle. There is also six days left for the whole tower to end. So I definitely, definitely have to get to the battle, uh, the hundredth battle at least, because I really doubt I'm gonna get close to the two hundredth. But I want to go past the hundredth battle at least. Ooh, I got an X-ray. I'm just gonna use my second. I could use the X-ray, but I prefer not to. Stupid scorpion stalling me. Hundred percent. And he is defeated. There we go. Test the first match. Oh, I got a support for Kenji. It's rank IX now. One more rank for it to be maxed. It gives uh, Kenji 30% bonus health, so that's great. I got our objective complete, nice. Alright, next battle is Treacherous Tanya, Classic Reptile, and Nimble Reptile. The modifier is enranged. Enemies power up more quickly. Alright. I'm wondering who's gonna be the boss for the 80th match. If I remember, it should be a boss by for the 80th match. I think every even number, like every 20 battles, it's a boss. So I'm sure there's gonna be a boss. I'm gonna finish him off with Jade <clears throat> just because it'll be fun. Oh damn, I did not expect that. I guess he has a um he had something personal with Jade. Because that seemed very personal to me. The way he spit at her face, all that toxic energy. Alright, next match. Okay, Combat Cup, Johnny Cage, Smoke, Triborg, and Black Dragon, Aaron Black. The modifier is Dark Magic. Your team takes damage as the match goes on. Only martial artists are safe. Luckily, my, my three characters are martial artists. Well, at least Jade and Hellspawn Scorpion are half martial artist but still it counts so I'm so I'm good why do you have to block oh, okay good I was thinking he was gonna use his power drain but luckily his special wasn't ready so he did not get to use it 100%. Did 
There we go. Another 100% and he is defeated. Awesome. Oh, heck yeah. I got a equipment, a rare equipment, Celestial Blow. It's an accessory for Fujin. It increases his critical hit chance boost from 15 to 16%. And increases his chance for basic attack to be unblockable from 25% to 26%. And then when once it's unlocked to level X, it gets 20% power generation boost. So... I'll have to wait whenever I do max it in rank. Alright, so now there's classic Jax Briggs, Dragon Breath Boracho, and Bojutsu Kong Jin. The modifier is Resurrection, enemies resurrect after being defeated. Not much of a problem, but it does take up some time. So it's basically like battling um, three Jason Borgs Unstoppable who resurrects once after getting defeated. So one resurrection. It would have been great if I had, um, what's his name? Strike Force Johnny Cage who gets a bar of power after an enemy resurrects. That would have been great. Why do they capture block all the time? They just stall me. Like, they know they're not gonna win. Like, I'm the main character here, not them. Alright, one more to go. And he's blocking again. That's fine. Kenshi is very powerful, so he defeated him with, even though he's, he was blocking, with one shot. Awesome, another rare, <coughs> another rare equipment. This time it's Kintaro's Tiger's Eye. And now it's maxed to rank X. Oh, look at that. That artwork is very cool. Heck yeah. So 50% basic attack basic attack damage boost. For Kintaro only, 20% chance to apply bleed dot on basic attacks that does 11.5 damage. Wait, um, I don't get that, but whatever. 25% damage boost against enemies affected by bleed or poison. So very cool. Glad I got that. Maxed. Because who knows when Kintaro's, Kintaro's uh, challenge is going to be. At least I don't know. Anyways, the next opponents are Warlock Quan Chi, MK11 Cabal, and Elder God Kenshi. The modifier is Vampires, and enemies drain your life to regain their own. Alright, this should be the last battle for now. Then I'm going to record like two or three other videos and then come back to this one for the Fatal Elder Wind Tower. I mean Fatal Sorcerer's Tower. I'm, I'm like very used to saying Fatal Elder Wind Tower when it, when it was when it was available of course. Eighty five percent. There we go. One more left. He's annoying to face, but he's actually very cool. I would like to have him as a character. He seems to attack very quick. The cabal. Unfortunately <coughs> unfortunately he's a diamond character, so he's very hard to get. Unless uh, I get lucky to get him in a pack or so. Since this is the fatal version of the tower, 
I believe in the 100th match once you beat it there's a chance to get a diamond character because that's what happened in the fatal elder wind tower I got I think yeah it was cold war Sonya and blade who I got which is the reason why I have her maxed so there's a possibility I could get like cabal or any diamond character basically if that's the case of getting a diamond character after the 100th match for any fatal tower so if that's a fact that will be great to get another diamond character after the 100th match so I'm looking forward to that if that's the case but anyways that's it for now I have nothing else to do I have to do, I have to do the Cyrax Triborg challenge later on possibly tomorrow because I have not done the stages at all yet but anyways for now I hope you guys enjoyed thanks for watching leave a like if you liked the video comment down below I guess thank and I'll see you guys in the next Mortal Kombat X video